Hey everybody and welcome back to the cooking corner. Good morning. Today we're going to show you how to make an amazing, easy, and delicious breakfast. This is going to be chocolate croissants. You are going to be the king or queen of croissants. As you can see, they look amazing. Audio, do me a favor and drop me that beat. This breakfast doesn't take long at all. It'll only take a matter of minutes with a couple ingredients. So, do chef a favor, put the cornflakes back in the cupboard, and let's get cooking. Start off with your obviously freshly baked croissants. Looks like chef just made these this morning and put them in this container. And then just cut a slit into the middle and then open them up. Whoa, easy there, chef. Put molest in that croissant. And I'll go ahead and put some uh, chocolate inside. If you can figure out a better filling, by all means, let us know. But chocolate works great. In a large bowl, go ahead and add your sugar, your cornstarch, and then your cinnamon. And you're gonna just mix these all together. All the ingredients are gonna be down below in the description, as well as in our blog, check those out. Add some milk, and then after every ingredient, just keep whisking. That's some good whisking, chef. Next up, crack some eggs. Looks like chef is cracking these with two hands. I made that joke a while back, and with the one hand now, I think he took it personally. You're gonna add a little bit of half and half, and that was a little bit of vanilla, because I wasn't paying attention, of course. You're gonna go adjust your pants, and now keep whisking. I don't know what he's doing today. As you can see, chef's got his shirt back on. He's rocking his ring again. Therapy worked. His wife didn't take a peel in me, but we tried. Oh, well. So next up, we're going to go ahead and place our croissants on a nice sprayed pan. And now we're just going to go ahead and you can use a brush. We're going to see how long this takes, Chef. And everyone knows he doesn't have the most patience. Yeah, I figured he would do this. Okay, just go ahead and dunk them in. Just be careful they don't fall right in or else you're going to have a mess. Like Chef's doing. Make sure your oven, however, is now preheated to 400 degrees. And you can use the brush towards the end to just touch up any of the croissants that may have dripped off. Seven to nine minutes in the oven. Take them out. They're going to be nice and golden. That glaze is going to be... Just perfectly done. Chocolate's going to be melted. Go ahead and plate these right up. Give them a few minutes to cool down a little bit. They're going to be really hot. Not to mention, we'll give a little bit more time for that chocolate to melt. And then just go ahead and serve these up with any other breakfast sides like fruit or a nice tall glass of milk would be perfect. We really hope you did enjoy this recipe. Chef did say the ingredients down below. You can actually probably cut them in half because of how much of the glaze he had left over. But... It didn't take long at all. Uh, a few minutes to put this together and to cook and you got yourself an awesome recipe. Definitely click on that picture of that girl that's popping up of our staff member to subscribe. Um, there's some videos that are gonna pop up as well. Other videos you haven't seen yet, click those. Please subscribe if you haven't yet. I know everyone asks, but we do it for a reason. Also, please share this on any social media. It would help us out a lot, it really would. Thank everyone for just dropping by today. Always remember, cooking should be fun. Have fun doing it. 